so this is the front of the house. And this is the neighborhood, a little bit of the neighborhood anyway. There is some construction happening in this neighborhood, but I think it's pretty much mostly built out. So let's do a quick walkthrough for you. Cute porch here. You can see the nice stone detail. So when you walk in, the formal dining room is on your left and the stairs. Pretty wood floors that are in good shape. House smells clean, which is nice. It's got a nice size living room. This is gonna be a coat closet here. Good size. Got the little puppies hanging out over here. <laughs> and then beautiful kitchen. Absolutely gorgeous. Eat-in area, sliding glass doors. Nice size screened porch and a brick paper patio. And it's got a decent sized yard. It's all fenced in. And on the other side of the fence over there is a pond. So that just gives you an idea about that. But the kitchen is really, really pretty. It looks like, looks like a quartz countertop, but I think it's granite. Stainless appliances. And then from the stove, this is the view out. And then you have a big pantry here. Is nice. You've got a little hallway. Um, I can find a light switch. Okay. So, good size laundry here. Hallway into the kitchen from the garage. And then you've got a nice size powder room as well. Hi. <laughs> so, nothing fancy, but standard. And then two car garage. I was gonna say, let me find the light, but it came on for me anyway. It's got some good shelving built in. So, there's that. So that pretty much rounds out the downstairs. over there. I don't know what it is. So, we head upstairs. The carpet is not in the best shape. You can tell they have animals, for sure. Up at the top of the stairs, you have a nice little landing. They've put a little desk here. And this is the master, right at the top of the stairs to the left. So this is a good size. This is a queen size bed. But you've got plenty of room. Bathroom has a double vanity, tile floor, shower, and a really big garden tub. And then the, the closet is also a really good size. Not insanely huge, but it is a really good size. Right across from the master, we have another bedroom that has a nice size walk-in closet. Really big, big closet for a secondary bedroom. And then it's got a little Oh, not even that little, but a nook over here that would be good for a desk or something like that. So, decent size bedroom. All right, we'll go down this hallway, we'll find the hall bathroom. Cute tile floor again, single sink. 
then, oh, this is huge. Really good size. Third bedroom. I mean, really good, big, big bedroom. A huge closet. Gosh, all the bedrooms have big walk-in closets so far. That one overlooks the backyard. So you can see the pond that I was talking about. I don't know if you can see it better here. Yep. It's a huge bedroom. It's almost the same size as the master. And then over on the other side of this is another gigantic bedroom. My gosh. This is huge. And another big walk-in closet. I mean, now this is a huge walk-in closet. So, four really good-sized bedrooms, all with a walk-in closet, which is amazing. The carpet's really not in bad shape here in the bedrooms. It's just up the stairs. It's not, not in the best shape. And then there's a linen closet here at the end of the hallway as well. Kind of adjacent to the bathroom there. So that is it. Let me know what you think.